Hey guys, what's up? Apple Critics here, and today this is going to be my video on how to uh, get uh, the dashboard on the Apple iPad. So, uh, in this video, I'll be giving an overview of the dashboard for iPad as well as how to get dashboard. Now, this dashboard is exactly the same dashboard as you see on Mac OS X and on the MacBook, the MacBook Pro, and the iMacs. So, what you'll do is open up Cydia. Once you open up Cydia, you'll go to search and then you'll search for Dashboard right there. And Dashboard basically is inspired from the Apple's Dashboard application for Mac. And now this application was rejected from the App Store because Apple didn't want it in their App Store. So now you'll simply tap on Dashboard. Once you tap in on Dashboard, you'll see that it gives you a view of uh, the instructions for the dashboard as well as some screenshots and uh, some more statistics and in the bottom in the top right corner you see that it says uh, confirm and install so then you'll simply install that and then you can exit out of Cydia once you exit out of Cydia you'll see that there's a new icon on your springboard right there and it's sort of like a widget icon right there so now you'll tap on that icon and then you'll be presented with some widgets on the screen. Uh, so you can add many more widgets than I currently have on the screen and it's just a great app. So on the bottom right you see that it says an uh, X right there and find new widgets. Now once you X out of that, it'll give you a plus icon in the bottom left corner. Now you'll simply uh, tap on that and now it'll give you a, a sort of like a cover flow view and it's very simple. Now you can easily move and rearrange uh, dashboard widgets, it's very simple. And if you don't like that widget, you can simply tap on the X on the top left corner. Right there. And it gives you a little effect when you uh, delete it. So right there you see that the widgets are working you can scroll through this widget right there using the scroll menu right there and you also see that uh, there is a weather widget at the top a calculator and an ESPN widget uh, which you can easily change and you can easily modify all of these widgets so you see that there is a little uh, icon right there uh, to edit it and you can simply expand and uh, contract the widget and it'll give you a little weather view on that weather widget. Now the next one you see that is a calculator you can easily use it and then it works. And now you see that there's a widget which basically is a widget where you uh, rearrange the icon. Now it's uh, those are basically the widgets. You can easily add more, uh, but I won't add more. So thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and rate 5 stars. Thanks for watching.